Root vegetables are a delicious and versatile part of winter months. They lend themselves to soups and stews, side dishes and salads. Dave, are you a, you're a root guy or a root guy? Root vegetables are root, the best. Root vegetables. Root Belinda vegetables. and Sue Morris have great recipes to share from Kowalski's. Today we're really going to talk about the root vegetables. I see just a beautiful assortment of them right there. So tell me why those are really good for you. Root vegetables, I think we get sad about summer and missing some of that produce and root vegetables. We've got turnips and rutabaga. I've got a bunch of them here, potatoes, fennel. They're so great because of their versatility. They're just really great raw or cooked. Some go both ways and they last a long time. So you could buy them and they can be in your refrigerator anywhere from two weeks to a couple of months. That's you remarkable. Should, yeah, look at storage, but they're economical for sure. Celery root, some of it's fun. You try stuff maybe you've never tried before. And then of course, just the nutrition piece. I mean, they're delicious, but then it gets, when you get that nutrition piece in and there's so much good from them because these little guys are sitting in the ground, which is what we're eating this, you know, bulb of the beet, but it's getting the nutrients out of the soil and concentrating them in the bulb. So you get vitamins and minerals and phytonutrients. You get um, some really great fiber that's all good for your gut, but it's sort of this really concentrated pull of nutrients from the soil that happens to end up in the bulb of the vegetable. Okay, so you're gonna show us two ways to eat them. So we have, uh, there's multiple ways. I mean, you can make hummuses out of them and sauces and all of that, but one of the recipes on your website is for mashed. And so I think a lot of times folks think, oh, mashed potatoes, so much carbohydrate. Ooh, maybe I don't want that. But we made a mix here and the recipe is Okay. rutabaga celery root and potato in there and just roasted and then mashed with some buttermilk and chives and it's really a great switch out and a really nutritious switch out for just straight up mashed potatoes and with these you don't need to use sour cream or butter they're good oh i love that i'm going to try that for sure what a good idea i can also get that my kids to eat that too because they love mashed potatoes so that might be really good yeah yeah so we're going to make today just a simple roasted version of um, some root vegetables. And so we've got parsnips and rutabaga and uh, turnips. And we're just going to put those all together. And rutabaga is a little bit more dense. So it's going to, you might want a little bit smaller chop for that just because it's going to take a little bit longer to cook. And then we're just putting in some olive oil on it, mixing that all around, and then putting it on a parchment lined tray. And you're gonna pop that in the oven at about 450 degrees for about 50 minutes. That okay. is the thing about root vegetables, they do take a little longer to cook. So you're gonna yeah. put a little glaze on it. Yep, so then the glaze comes on. So after about 50 minutes in the um, oven, then we're putting in a mixture of fresh thyme, paprika, salt, pepper, uh, a little bit of allspice, and a little bit of cayenne, and a little bit of cinnamon. Again, oh, the wow, that sounds great. Yeah, the recipe is on the website. And then we've got some lemon juice, fresh lemon juice. And I'm just gonna shake that up and then drizzle it over the vegetables here, pop it in the oven for about 10 minutes. And that allows the glaze to sort of absorb into those vegetables. And then we end up with this really wonderful, sweet mix of um, root vegetables that will knock your socks off. What we end up with is a lovely meal of those root vegetables and the fresh herb makes it really kind of a little bit of a bite of summer. And then you can partner with any kind of a meat if you want or go straight up vegetable. But I will say if folks don't wanna do all the slicing and dicing, we've got a root vegetable mix in our deli department that all you have to do is bring it home and heat and eat. It's sweet potatoes oh, and rutabaga. You know what, I have to say that I will actually pay more for that because I feel like I'm gonna cut my finger off. <laughs> I know, I did the rutabaga and the celery root and you need a really sharp knife and a really good bicep to get in there. <laughs> well, um, as always, Kowalski's is such a wonderful partner to work with. Sue, we so appreciate this segment. And again, all of this information, is, as you've mentioned, is on carolevin.com. And so get the root vegetables into your diet, right, Sue? All right, you have a great Saturday. Thanks, you as well. And we have that recipe and a link to Kowalski's site on care11.com. Text the word recipes to 763-797-7215. Text it, don't call it, to get a link to the recipes page.